We also a sad sight. The car is gone. No more cutlass, y'all. No more cutlass. Don't be talking like a drug, nigga. And so fast, man, my shot is never bug, nigga. He be talking. What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, I would like to welcome you to our family, you feel me? Before we get started, I need y'all to turn y'all phone up straight and click that like button. Then while you already down there, click that subscribe button and turn that post notification bell all the way. Y'all be notified every time I drop. Then I want y'all to go ahead and watch this video all the way to the end. And when the end screen pop up, y'all click on the last video I posted. Click on that video, watch that video, and hit the like button on that one too. You feel me? It it don't cost you nothing. It's free, and it helps me out, and it helps the channel out. Now I know y'all looking at the title and like, what you mean? What's going on? You finna sell the cutlass? So nah. The thing that's happening is I'm finally getting my fuel tank put on, which was supposed to be done by a different mechanic, but I'm taking it to a different shop. You feel me? If y'all catch what I'm saying, try not to confuse out confuse y'all too much but yeah the fuel tank finally get finna get put on and the sending unit and i think he gonna try and do my window motors too so i'm gonna basically just show y'all all that all the good stuff you feel me all the stuff we got and everything that's gonna get done to the car now like i said i don't know how long i ain't say this but i don't know how long it's gonna be how long it's gonna take him or how long he's gonna have the car but it don't bother me as long as the car is getting worked on you know so that's all that's really matter to me because I've been waiting on this car to get finished so I can start doing different stuff because I wanted to give y'all a driving video, point of view, uh, um, me cleaning out the inside of the car, me trying to run my speaker wire, trying to run the music wire and all that stuff. So it, like I said, it's it's been getting held up just because I don't have tags on the car and since I don't have tags on the car, the car has to just sit here which is what it was doing before I started working on the car. So I don't like that. I want to be able to get in this car and just go and get in and drive it. So the fact that I couldn't do that, even though I already sent it to a mechanic shop, was crazy because it was gone for what I say, like five months, six months. So the fact that I couldn't even drive it, that I still can't even drive it right now, is crazy. Cause I, like I said, I need that done. So once I can finally get the get this car to where I can get it, get in it and drive it, then I can go and get my tags on it, and I can do a lot of different stuff. You feel me? And I know y'all don't know, but I'm looking for tires for my stock wheels right now, so I can put my stocks back on. No tire shops down here had size 15 tires. You feel me? So I've I've been looking online and. I've been trying to wait for like different shops to get hopefully some even some used tires just something to where I can put my stocks back on and get them 222s off this car but I do need to get all four tires so I can have my stocks back on but yeah man other than that man this is gonna be a pretty quick short video we getting ready to send the cutlass well I'm gonna try and drive it that's what I think the plan is I'm gonna try and drive it to the mechanic shop which isn't the same mechanic that had this car already for a couple months it's gonna be a different mechanic but i know him too you feel me so he's a really good mechanic got his own shop his shop they do paint body work like they rebuild cars it's just you feel me they don't be having a lot of open space so when they when he told me he finally had an open space i told him yeah let's go ahead and get this done and so far he's just gonna do that because once I'm ready for paint, then I'm going to see if he can do it. If not, I'm going to find somebody else to do it. But other than that, man, like I said, hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Turn the post notification bell on. That way, I'll be notified every time I drop. Finna show y'all everything I got that he's hopefully going to be installing. And then the car should be running fine. So, yeah. Catch on in one second. Alright, so I don't know if y'all can tell, but I got all of the car covers off the car. Which is three of them because one of them is ripped. And all three is too short. So I just put three of them on there to, you feel me, try to keep the car covered and protected through this weather because the weather been a little bit crazy out here. But yeah, like I was telling y'all, I got a couple things that I wanted him to install. Now, hopefully, like I said, hopefully he can do it because this is the window motor. I'm pretty sure he can do it because he know what he does. So this, like I said, this is the window motor. So 
that's one thing I need for him to install. And there's two of them in there. One, two, y'all see? Two window motors in there, so that's, that's something. And then we got the fuel tank right here. Y'all see it poking up. So this big box is the fuel tank. And like I said, hopefully he can install this stuff because we need it installed. I know, hopefully. It, it, what I meant to say was, we finna be dropping this car off to get this stuff installed. So, yeah. And then we got then we got the sending unit, a brand new sending unit. Now, I know a lot of people have been asking me where do I find all my parts for, from? Where do I get a lot of my parts from? And eBay, really, I just literally type into my vehicle and save it, and then just get it from eBay. Or a couple people told, well not a couple people, one person told me from the comments, told me to go to Original Parts Group, and they got cutlass parts you feel me and that's what I'm on right now see obgi.com and they just type in your car and they got just about every part you need if not every part you need you know them and eBay is really the only places and then um it's one more site I was using I forgot what it's called and uh, I think I deleted it off my thing see that's what I get for deleting stuff but yeah, them the, them the two places I get all my parts for from. But I want to do a quick walk around for one to save everything, and so I know what's all in my car. And then, cause you know, most mechanic shops not responsible for anything being stolen and stuff. So if anything is gone, all I gotta do is come back to this video, and I know. Now the only th the only three things that should be leaving out of this car is the two window motors that's if he decides to put them in because i didn't i didn't ask him to but i will when i get to his shop but for sure for sure is the sending unit and the fuel tank them the only two things that's really supposed to be going in there because i haven't told him about the window motors but i'm gonna tell him about them when i get to him so the window motor should be leaving too so the only three things should be is these two front boxes in this front seat and the big box in the back everything else should be exactly where it is this I need to take out. I need to take out that one and that one and then get them speakers out. So I'm going to definitely take them out. But we got our big sending unit. When I say sending unit, think about the fuel tank. We got our big 9 inch dual screen radio. And ain't even dual, but screen radio. Y'all get what I'm saying, bro. But yeah, we got this and then we got our EQ. The EQ is not plugged in, but the radio is. And like I said, some is draining my battery and I don't know what it is. Cause my battery, we look at this again. I'm gonna have to jump the car. It's dead. So I'm gonna have to figure that out. Now the car was doing this before it even left, so that's why I don't know. I, I don't. I really don't. Grab the key. But yeah, a quick little walk around. We've done a lot so far to this. Not even really a lot quick little walk around dual exhaust I'm gonna end up getting the exhaust and the new exhaust tips on this car too because the exhaust is like kind of rusty and I think it, it might have an exhaust leak so I'm gonna end up getting all that redone too and I still need to get this rear bumper pulled out some because y'all can see it's a huge little gap right there and there ain't none on the passenger side so I need to get that pulled and we walk on to the front Euro clip we supposed to have one. I still gotta find it. I ain't really been looking, but I gotta try and find it. So yeah, it ain't really much. Like I said, I gotta get the originals so I can put my originals back on. It's only been sitting like this for about a week and a half, maybe. That's because it was supposed to have been leaving and since it never left, it's just been sitting. I'm finna take out one, two, three, four, five, and take all five of those out. Those three is gonna stay. I gotta put them up inside to 
the actual rear deck those two are staying because I don't know which amp I'm gonna use yet probably the kicker amp uh, we're gonna be doing a carpet once we get it back this speaker box I don't think I'm gonna be using because I just got another speaker box for free I don't know if y'all seen that video yet but y'all y'all be on the lookout for that video but yeah I got an extra speaker box and I got extra 12s too if I want to end up putting it in something else if I end up getting another car actually but yeah like I said I'm gonna take out all one two three four five I'm gonna take out all five of those and put them in my charger so I can go put them up but yeah y'all other than that that should be it like I said we're gonna be gonna be getting hopefully the window motors put in too but we need to get this city unit and the fuel tank and that's supposed to make the car run better that's what the other mechanic said and he was supposed to do it but now we're getting it done by somebody else and hopefully 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 that makes the car run a little bit better but when I get ready to start the car and move the car, I'm going to come back to y'all and give y'all a quick little cold start because I'm going to have to get my jump box and jump the car off and all that stuff. So, until then, see y'all in a second. Alright y'all, so it's a good sight to see but also a sad sight. The car is gone. No more cutlass y'all, no more cutlass. For now. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's gone for now. So, yep, 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 yep. All right, y'all. So, yeah, the cutlass is gone. Like I said, for now, it ain't gonna be permanently gone. But if y'all enjoyed this little quick little vlog, man, it was just me showing y'all basically what's going on with the cutlass, telling y'all. And informing y'all what's going on with the colors then letting us see our final little goodbye because ain't no telling how long it's gonna be gone hopefully it ain't too too long bro but then again i, I want the car to be right so i'm not like i said i don't like rushing people because i don't like to be rushed myself so i'm not gonna rush anybody i'm on their time on i'm on their clock so it is what it is for now until we get the car back then we can start doing different stuff with it you feel me i can start driving it for y'all bring it by the box and while it's gone right now, I'm finna be trying to find four 15-inch tires. Hopefully, I don't spend no more than $200 for all four because, you feel me, it's just 15s. But then again, ain't no telling how much because, you feel me, these tire shops is high. So, other than that, man, like I said, I appreciate y'all for tuning in. Y'all hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new, turn that post notification bell to all. I got to run out here to Office Max so I can get me another memory card. And... I gotta run back out there to the car shop so I can get the dude the keys. And then, I, like I said, I need to find four tires so I can take them 22s off because I just drove it and, and it's rubbing bad. So, like when I turn, it's rubbing, which I already knew was gonna happen. I would have to get the front end frame notch and the rear end frame notch. I already knew that. But it is what it is. Like I said, for now, I just wanna rock with my stocks anyways because it's. Well, it, you feel me? I, I'm a, well, this is the only car I got with rims on it, but both my old schools are on stock, so I just wanted to keep them on stocks for now. So, and until I get paint, once I get paint, then I'll throw wheels on and figure out wheels and stuff. But like I said, for now, I just want to rock with my stock. So, appreciate y'all for tuning in. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. If you're new, turn that post notification bell to all the way. Y'all be notified every time I drop. It's going to be the end of this when I catch on the next one.